Okay, so in your video today, I'm going to make you a lesson about your E string note practice. So we started learning about the notes of the E string. So it's this guy, which I will upload to your Google Drive, so you'll have a copy of this. So our notes on the E string, if you remember, are E, F, G, and A. So here's where we have a couple options. We can choose some sharps. So common would be F sharp. We don't very often play an F natural, especially in violin music. Um, so you would probably just want to go straight to your F sharp. Okay. We also can do a G sharp, which would be one whole step away. So my fingers are a little farther apart. And then to do your A, it would be right next to the G sharp. Okay, so if we do natural, we have E, F, G, A. If we do with the sharps, E, F, G, A. And you can also do a G natural. So you have E, F sharp, G natural, A. And that's common too. You see both a lot, G and G sharp. So we're just gonna practice, first of all, just running through those. So we're gonna do all the naturals first. So we're gonna go E, F natural, G natural, A. Okay, now let's try with F sharp. So we're gonna go E, F sharp, G natural, A. And see how close my two and three are. And the last one we're gonna do is all sharps. So E, F sharp, G sharp, A. And now my G sharp and A fingers, my three and my two are really close together. Okay, so your song that I printed out has all the naturals. So what I want you to do is go through it, and I know we've done this before in class, so you should be good at it by now, is go through it and write sharps in front of every single X. Remember you're drawing like that little hashtag symbol? That's a sharp, right in front of the F. Okay, so you can go through and do all of the Fs. Um, I'm pretty sure we did a couple of them in class, so it shouldn't be too hard. And then we're going to leave the G's as natural, okay? So for the first line, it goes E, F sharp, G, A. Um, but I want to do a G natural. Yeah, we're going to do G natural, so you can do a low G. So instead, it'll sound like this. So it's going to sound a little bit sad, but that's okay. So only the F's as sharps, okay? So I'm going to play through the whole thing one time so you know what it sounds like. And then I'll go through a little bit slower and you can try and play along. So here's the whole thing. So now I'm going to go through as much as I can, quite a bit slower. So I want you to try, pick up your violin if you don't have it right now, and see if you can play along. Okay? So going much slower, so we're going to go E, F sharp, G, A, A, F, 2, G, G, 2, 3, 4, big bow, A, 2, 3, 4, F, for 1, 2, Rest, another F, E, F, 2, E, F, E, F, 2, E, G, F, 2, G, A, G, A, G, F, 2, 3, 4, tried to do the counting and the notes so hopefully you caught both in there but I'm gonna go through the first uh, first line one more time and this time I'm not gonna say the note names all I'm gonna do is the counting okay so one two three four 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 okay so that was the first line with all the counts in there. So you can try that at home too. So practice a couple different ways. Practice it saying your note names and practice it just saying your counts. So it's good to try both of those, okay? And remember, you're only doing the F sharp.
So give that a try. That's your E string. And once you get really comfortable with your E string notes, it'll open up a lot more um, tunes for us to try using the A and the E string.